What's up world, my name is Mr. Vaca, and in today's video, we're gonna take a look at my favorite Chrome extension called Screencastify. This tool is very useful if you want to make a video by either capturing your entire screen, part of your screen, or just a browser tab, or even if you wanna make a video and record just yourself, or even just your voice, the free version of Screencastify does all of those things. So without further ado, let's dive in. The first thing you wanna make sure is that you've gone to screencastify.com and installed the Chrome extension. Then once you've done all of that and logged in, when you click on the puzzle piece icon in the top right corner of the Chrome URL bar, you're gonna see all of your Chrome extensions appear in a little drop down menu. Now you'll also have the ability to select the pin icon to the right of that extension name. It will turn it blue and that allows you to keep that icon pinned in that URL bar. So if you use Screencastify a lot, like how I do, you'll be able to easily access that extension without needing to just do the extra clicks of going, hitting the puzzle piece and then to the extension arrow Screencastify icon. You'll then want to click on the Screencastify icon and you'll be prompted to choose one of three options. Do you want to record just a browser tab, your entire screen, or just the webcam and microphone? If you choose the first two options, either the browser tab or your entire screen, you have the ability, if you look down below a little bit, to embed your webcam, which will put your picture right on top or in the corner of your recording, which is some of the things that I do with my editing using Final Cut Pro. But this is right in Screencastify and it makes it so easy to connect with your audience by putting your picture on top of what you're looking at on your screen. Above that is the ability to embed your audio with your microphone. So if you wanna talk, you just click on that and you can use a voiceover but not include your picture by clicking the microphone making sure that that's on and then turning your webcam off so that way when you're speaking and you're recording what you're doing on your screen it'll all be combined into one video the next step is pretty easy all you have to do is hit record and then you'll automatically be set to a three two one countdown and then you'll be live after you finish your demonstration or creating your video, you're gonna look in the bottom left hand corner for the toolbar where you're going to hit the stop button. After you hit that stop button, the recording will automatically open up in a new tab. As long as you've linked Screencastify to your Google account, it will also automatically create a folder within your Google Drive to locate all of your recordings. And this is just the tip of the iceberg of all the amazing things that Screencastify has to offer. In our next video, we're gonna take a look at how to locate all of your recordings, how to rename them, and how to even edit them by clipping the beginning, clipping the end, and so much more. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button, notification bell, so you don't miss any future episodes. And if you've made it this far, you are awesome. Thank you again so much for watching. Don't forget to work hard, play hard, and I'll catch you next time.